not going to do that. I know the snipes are good and all, but... Don't feel like resolving. Dark is more consistent, yeah, for sure. Especially on on um, big sets of panels, like, mostly oranges, but just generally most of mountain. my left, well of A, my left button input, um, before I clicked in, which means I had full forward momentum for my slide. If that makes any sense. Rather than having leftward momentum, or forward and left. Kind of weird how that works. Last part of the panel was good. Getting stuck on the stairs was not. Good enough. That was a good triple. start should be somewhere in the vicinity of 420 
good enough monastery. I really need to just not lose time on bunker and then we should be fine. Good. Whatever. It was fine. Didn't lose a whole lot of time. about half a second. I didn't have to correct my lineup, but I'd rather be safe there. It's only a second. The branch is covering the corner, but sometimes you can still squeak your thing past the... squeak the line past the branch. Not sure if that's the right verb to use, but whatever. Now we see if our practice paid off. 917 is um, world record split on Marsh. every hour and a half, time after time after time. You wake up usually in the mornings, and just the way that the track of your orbits go, you wake up over the Mideast, over North Africa. As you eat breakfast, you look out the window as you're going past, and there's the Mediterranean area, and Greece, and Rome, and North Africa, and the sun, the whole area. And you realize that in one glance, that what you're seeing is what was the whole history of a man for years. 
the cradle of civilization. And you go around down across North Africa and out over the Indian Ocean and look up at that great subcontinent of India pointed down toward you as you go past it. And Ceylon off to the side, Burma, Southeast Asia, out over the Philippines and up no, across that monstrous doing? Pacific Ocean, vast body of water. You've never realized how big that is before. And you finally come up across the coast of California and look for those friendly things. Los Angeles and Phoenix and on across El Paso. And there's Houston. There's home. And you look and sure enough, there's the Astrodome. And you identify with that, you know? It's an attachment. And down across New Orleans, oh, wow. and then looking down to the south, and there's the whole peninsula of Florida laid out. Please give and me And all the, the hundreds of hours you spent flying across that route, down in the atmosphere, all that is friendly again. And you go out across the Atlantic Ocean and back across Africa. And you do it again, and again, and again. And that identity... Oh, that you identify with Houston Too and much then time. you identify with Los Angeles and Phoenix and New Orleans and <sighs> See, this is just so and different from a practice setting because I'm actually shaking or shaking. I'm just nervous now. You look forward to that. You anticipate it. That's and what really messes is. me up. That whole process begins to shift of what it is you identify with. When you go around it in an hour and a half, whether or not I'm going slow, I'm still going to be shaking. That your identity is with that whole thing, and that makes a change. You look down there, and you can't imagine how many borders and boundaries you crossed again and again and again, and you don't even see them. At that wake-up scene, the Mideast, you know there are hundreds of people killing each other over some imaginary line that you can't see. From where you see it, the thing is a whole. Good multi-panel. It's so beautiful. And you wish you could take one from each side in hand and say, look at it from this perspective. Look at that. What's important? It's an okay, what's important. And so a little later on, your friend, Couple seconds again, behind. those same neighbors, another astronaut, the person next to you on goes out to the of blue. And now he looks back and sees the Earth, Optimally. not as something big where he can see the beautiful details, but he sees the Earth as a small thing out there. It's a good map, too, though. that contrast between that bright blue and white Christmas tree ornament and that black sky, that infinite universe. Wow, well, I can't click really on that circle. Comes the size of it, the significance of it. Oh, that's it a lot of chat. Dude, two P speedrun give Darkit so the mouse small, before mountain. So yeah. And such Collaborator speedruns would be pretty nuts. Give Gilly the mic. That you can block it out Sounds like a good block. idea. And you realize that it could be an AGDQ thing, that little blue or SGDQ, or GDQ in general. Everything that means anything to you. Split. I don't know. I can't all see of it. history and music and poetry That's and all art good, though. and war and death and birth and love, tears, joy, games, all of it is on that little spot out there that you can cover with your thumb. And you realize that that perspective. That you've changed. Bad meta. That there's something new there. That relationship is no longer good. what it was. Good random panels. And then you look back on the time when you were outside on the EVA. Good. And those few moments that you had the time because the camera malfunctioned. That you had the time to think about what was happening. And you recall staring out there at the spectacle that went before your eyes. Because now, you're no longer inside something with a window looking out at a picture. Now you're out there, and what you've got around your head is a goldfish bowl, and there are no limits here. Just depends on how fast no my early game no was now. You're really it's an okay there, mountain. Over it, floating, going 25,000 miles how per fast hour, I was. ripping through space, a vacuum, and there's not a sound. There's a silence, the depth of which you've never experienced before. And that silence contrasts so markedly with the scenery and the speed with which you know you're going. Uh, hello? Thank you. In any case, 
our three days old infant cannot be very confident of any interpretation it puts on our universe, which it only discovered a minute or two ago. Oh, that's slow. Hello? We have said it has 70 years of life before it, but in truth, oh, well, whatever. its expectation I don't care. of life would seem to be nearer to 70,000 years. <laughs> Messed up this wax strat. Stressed, often irritated at the apparent meaninglessness and incomprehensibility of the world to which it has suddenly wakened up. But it is still very young. Might travel half the world over. <sighs> Just barely. Just barely. Nice. Good time. 1540. Take a look at these splits. Two minute shadows, that's really good. 250 keep, that's the fastest I've ever had. 420 town, I called it. That's pretty interesting. Um, monastery was okay. Bunker was okay i'm not sure what how that compares to gold jungle is fine bunker laser i know i lost a bit of time there snipes i had to realign my lineup for the second one well i don't know if i had to but 905 is really good that's 12 seconds ahead of world record which means i bled or lost nine seconds compared to old world record um just in mountain that's okay 230 mountain two 231 Mountain 3, that's 6 seconds lost there. It's actually lost most of the time compared to Darkid and Mountain 3. Not sure where that happened. My floor puzzles weren't great. I guess my pillars weren't great, I don't know. Oh, and my meta was bad. But my random panels were okay, I'm not sure. Anyway. A bubble in a stream. A in a stream. Let's hear all the voice lines at the same time. The randoms were okay-ish. I mean, they weren't perfect, but it, I don't know. It wasn't six seconds lost on random panels. I guess Meadow is really bad. Still, 1540 is 1540. 